I just got back from taking my kids to school. Driving home gets you thinking because it's a 30 minute drive there and a 30 minute back. And um, this is that time of year where I start to doubt my business, doubt myself because I don't have really anything booked this week. And even though I kind of did on purpose, I've always prided myself in being a workaholic and um, it's not happening this week. Um, you know, it is happening with like emails and all that stuff, but I feel like my business is failing and I know that it's a, a side thing because I know I've done this every single year for my entire life. Um, but let's talk about this because you might have the same feelings. What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Um, if you're new, subscribe. Video helps you anyway. Give it a thumbs up and then click that bell for notifications. It'll tell you every time I come on. Guys, if you're a photographer into health, anything like that, feel free to go through my descriptions below. Um, there's a lot of coupon codes and links and all that stuff to help you guys out if you need anything that these companies have sent me. Um, but let's just do a little, <clears throat> let's do a little chatty chat right here, okay? So um, it's January. Holiday season's over. I'm gonna open up my tripod at the same time here. Um, holiday season is over. And we are in this little lull of time between, um, you know, spring portrait season, commercial uh, seasons coming up, and um, wedding season for me. Actually, I mean, I have weddings kind of throughout every single month. But I, I'm looking at my calendar, I'm looking at, you know, my income, my money this month, and I'm like, dude, I'm failing, like I'm not doing well. And it's just that time of year and I have to talk myself out of it. I have to talk myself out of this like light depression of being so busy, you know, um, especially for four months in a row where I'm just nonstop dying, working, you know, have no time to work out, have no time to do anything, where then I have to transition into where like I have like two weeks really off, right? So from like Christmas up until like maybe the first two weeks of January, I really just kind of close my schedule down. And I don't do it on purpose, but I just kind of push people out. I'm like, you know, I don't have anything available till mid-January. And then they book it. So um, like today, I'm gonna be doing some emails. I'll just do some catch up on things, maybe some receipts for the taxes and all that stuff. But I was kind of driving and then, you know, my, my issue is I go through social media and I'm scrolling through stories and I see a photographer shooting for a, a commercial company or a photographer out shooting some snow stuff for a family. And I'm like, why am I not doing that? I should be doing that. And I'm going to tell you guys this. I'm going to tell myself this. It's normal and it's okay for us to have a little bit of downtime. Um, it's actually necessary if you have a little bit of downtime, whether it's for family, traveling or whatever. Our creative minds as photographers, as artists, if we are go, go, go the whole time, we're gonna constantly do the same thing over and over again. And you know this, you know that when you do the same shoot, if you do a family shoot and all you shoot is families for the same week, you're gonna do the same thing and you start to go like, oh, this is boring, this is gross, I don't wanna do this. And that downtime will allow you to recoup your brain, to see other things and, and make sure that you are still passionate about what you do. If you're like me, if you take a couple weeks off, all of a sudden you go back, you're like, this is money, right? I'm super happy to be doing this. I'm, I'm you know, I really like doing this. And that's ultimately where you wanna be every single time that you do this. So, I'm gonna still feel this way for another couple hours. Uh, I'm gonna do some work. I'm gonna, you know, maybe catch up on a movie, Matrix is out, and um, kind of push out of it but it's important for you to take that time off. I mean, in fact, next week we're going to Disneyland for a few days to take the kids, use those passes that we have, and um, enjoy this time because I know that in a month from now I'm gonna be dying again up until the end of the year. So if you're like me, it's okay to have downtime, but it's also okay to feel this way, guys, because you're passionate about your business, you're self-run, we make our own money. If I sit on the couch all day, I don't, make a, I don't make a penny. Nobody's paying me to sit on the couch. They're only paying me to go work and do stuff, and being a life of an entrepreneur, that's what we have. So, if you guys are feeling it, let me know. Um, I'll also give you guys some tips and tricks, if you guys want, on uh, how, I, how I kind of you know pass the time. Anyways, I'll talk to you guys next time, bye.